How can you wrap up your answer? For example, we've already written an opening sentence or response as well as two supportive detail sentences. What should we do next? In this lesson, you will learn how to wrap up your answer by writing your reasons. For a constructed response, we take these steps. Analyze the prompt, find the evidence, judge the evidence, prepare the case, and finalize the case. And we're still right here just finishing up the writing of our response. A common mistake is writing a conclusion that only summarizes what you already said. You might think, let's just review what happened. And that's a lot of times what writers do. But the reader then thinks, wait, you already told me that. We're going to take some steps here to make sure that doesn't happen. First, ask yourself, why did I choose this answer? And that's a really important question. Second, write a sentence to explain. Third, ask yourself, is my answer complete? Let's get started. First, ask yourself, why did I choose this answer? Well, I remember when I did it, I, I, um, I thought there was a lot of evidence that the family did think that Alexis was part of the family, but there were just a few things that made, they, they just were such strong things that happened that it like made it seem like there, there was no way I could say that answer. So I guess um, here's what I think. There was plenty of evidence that the Grays loved Alexis and treated her well but in the end, I just don't think family members should have to worry about being beaten or having their children given away. And that's what I think. Now we have to write a sentence to explain. Hmm. Okay, well, my, th my thoughts are a little long and rambling, so let's see if we can wrap it up. Even though the Grays treated Alexis kindly, a member of a family should never have to worry about being beaten or sold. Yeah, that's my reason. Now I'm going to go back to my whole answer. Here it is. And I'm going to ask myself a few questions so that I can make sure that it's complete and, and, um, and that I'm really done. So does this give an opinion? Because that's what the prompt asks for. Yes, here it is. In my opinion, the Grays did not feel like Alexis, their dog, was just like a member of the family because Mr. Gray hit her and sold her puppy. Does it tell reasons? Yes, down here, I say that even though the Grays treated Alexis kindly, a member of a family should never have to worry about being beaten or sold. And is it supported by evidence? That's what the prompt also asked. Yes, here it is. In the story, Mr. Gray struck Alexis with his cane. In the second paragraph on page 5, it says Mr. Gray sold Alexis's puppy. So I do think my answer is complete. Here are the steps to our lesson. Ask yourself, why did I choose this answer? Write a sentence to explain. And then ask yourself, is my answer complete? In this lesson, you have learned how to wrap up your answer by telling your reasons.